Hello everyone, I'm going to try to find the magnitude and phase angle for this Fourier series. And just to remind you how we get the magnitude first. It's going to equal, sorry about that, the D is going to equal the square root, square the real number first, then square the imaginary number. And for the phase, simply enough, it's going to be the inverse tangent of the imagined number over the real number uh, and th by the way this is for the e to the jt if we have for example e to the j pi we are gonna just simply take the the number next to the j which is pi in this case and this is gonna be the phase so for the finished one we are going to take the simple one here so the magnitude for this one is equal square root of the real number squared the real number here in our case is 1 squared added to the imaginary number but in this case we don't have the imaginary number so it's going to equal 1 and for the phase just to explain it here the phase for this one is going to equal uh, pi the number next to the j next we have the d1 and by the way I'm gonna d do the d1 and do the d negative 1 because they equal each other so the square root of the real number we are gonna have the same case as the above so it's gonna be square root of the 1 squared equal 1 and for the phase uh, d1 equal and the d negative 1 which equal sorry about that which equal 0 and it's gonna be equal 0 because if we take the inverse tangent of the imaginary number which is 0 uh, over 1 it's gonna equal 1 Next we have the d to negative 2 So and by the way d negative 2 is this one So the ma uh, it's gonna equal the magnet uh, the square root of the real number the real number in our case is b negative 1 squared added to the uh, 3 which is imaginary number squared equals square root of 10 after that for the phase simply we are going to do the same thing so d of negative 2 which equal the inverse tangent of the imaginary number which is 3 over negative 1 and this is gonna give us 70, uh, negative 71.57 uh, finally the last one d equal which is this one by the way the, uh, the square root over negative 1 which is real number added to the imaginary number which is negative 3 squared equal square root of 10 and the D the phase sorry about that the phase for this one is gonna equal the inverse tangent of negative 3 over negative 1 which is 71.47 simply for the magnitude we just take the square root of the squared real number added to the squared imaginary number and for the phase we take the inverse tangent uh, and it's gonna be j over r which is the imaginary number over real number and by the way thank you for watching and hopefully I'm going to see you soon. Thank you.